like the washboard equivalent on the highway. So we are on our way to New Orleans from the Boulevard Peninsula in Texas. And uh, we stopped uh, overnight at like a roadside park, but uh, there's a mountain bike trail nearby. So we got up a little early and we're gonna go take a little ride this morning. I think it's only like 1.2 miles, so, but I think it'll be fun. That's fun. Really fun. I enjoyed it. It was fun just to go over the jumps, even though we can't do jumps yet. Uh, but it was a lot of fun. We would have taken one of the dogs. Um, as you can see, they're antsy. We would have taken Oakley um, to give her a shot at being a trail dog because dogs are allowed off leash in that area. Um, however, there is a shooting range not too far away and she is terrified of gunshots, really any loud noise. And so this is how she would rather spend her time. <sighs> She's scared, so we're not gonna try it. Ella's a little bit too wound up uh, to practice being a trail dog right now because we haven't played fetch in a little while. So we're not gonna give her a shot at it either. However, it would have been the perfect place because there was no one else there. But that's all right. We're gonna go ahead and head on to New Orleans. We made it to our site. It's a little park in or near downtown New Orleans that has some designated sites uh, for boondocking. I don't think there's like maybe 13 of them or something, but. There's one other RV here, uh, one tent camper, and then just some people that look like they're here just for the day, fishing and whatnot. Plenty of open green space for Ella to play fetch, so she's loving it. Which means we're loving it too. Ella's very happy. This is all Ella really wants in life, is a big grassy field to play fetch in. We're trying to figure out what these things are. So if you know, leave it in the comments because we're really curious and Google cannot really help us. Now we're going to go head downtown with the dogs and see if we can uh, go find some stuff to do to occupy ourselves for the rest of the afternoon. We'll probably check out the French Quarter and Bourbon Street and all that stuff. Uh, get some dinner, hopefully find some place with a patio we can bring the dogs. And then I think tomorrow morning we might try and go uh, kayaking with the gators in the swamp. This is Lindsay's idea. So She says I owe her because I dragged her 220 feet up the cliff. So.
we are at Cafe Beignet in the French Quarter of New Orleans. We just had a late lunch or early dinner at uh, Sobu, I think is what it's called. It was a really cool restaurant. Um, they have like a pool and patio area out in the back and you can order your food at the bar if you have dogs. So that was, that was fun. Uh, so now we are waiting for our beignets and I'm super excited. Yay, New Orleans. Hot, fresh, handmade beignets. Look at this Ellen. Oh, they're hot. Be careful. Oh. Good. Look at that. Just look at that. Mmm. It's good. <laughs> Awesome. So good. It's like an elephant ear, but thicker, fluffier, and with powdered sugar. So, very good. They're so good. Beignets are awesome. If you haven't had one, you must. They're so delicious. So that's the best part. The second best part is when Ella peed in the street because that was just hilarious. <laughs> she had to go so bad and there's no grass or like any mulch, nothing. We looked, we knew she had to go and she just like peed in the middle of a crosswalk. <laughs> it was pretty funny. <laughs> Ella liked it. She did so good. I think Oakley missed being a city dog just for a moment, but we're ready to get back to the wilderness, kind of. Where we parked is kind of wilderness, not really, but <laughs> it'll do. Yeah. 